Could they do it? Could NASA actually change the orbit of an asteroid as the sort of a practice run for the one day when one might hurtle toward Earth and kill us all? The dry run mission called the Double Asteroid Redirection Test, or DART for short. It was the first try of its kind, and now NASA reports it worked even better than scientists had expected. Here's NBC's Tom Costello. From 7 million miles away, photographic proof that NASA's DART mission worked. That exploding cloud of dirt and rock, the moment the refrigerator-sized spacecraft slammed into an asteroid named Dimorphos, orbiting an even bigger asteroid. The impact gave Dimorphos a big shove, dramatically shortening its orbit even more than NASA had hoped. It was expected to be a huge success if it only slowed the orbit by about 10 minutes but it actually slowed it by 32 minutes. Traveling at 14,000 miles per hour, DART's nose camera caught the final seconds before impact. While the asteroid poses no risk to us, NASA is hoping it can one day use the same technique to divert a massive meteor on a collision course with Earth, a so-called planet killer like the one that killed off the dinosaurs 65 million years ago. Warning time is really key here in order to enable this sort of asteroid deflection to potentially be used in the future. NASA says it's not not tracking any asteroid known to pose an imminent threat to Earth, but there may be others it doesn't see. Ideally, scientists would have decades of warning to use a similar deflection technique and save humanity. All of us have a responsibility to protect our home planet. After all, it's the only one we have. For the news, I'm Tom Costello.